Okay, hello, welcome to my vlog. And I just wanted to start it here because I'm not gonna wanna start it at 3 a.m. tomorrow. Yeah, but I just wanted to give a little introduction before you watch the rest of this video. So Crumble Cookies is sending me and my boyfriend out to Utah to go celebrate their fifth birthday tomorrow. And I'm so, so, so excited. I've never been to Utah. This will be my first time. And yeah, I'm just really excited. I'm just like preparing for it right now. The only thing is I have to get up at 3 a.m. tomorrow morning. So I'm not excited about that. I'm just gonna like pack and chill the rest of the night, but I just wanted to do like a quick introduction before you see the rest of this video. I am so excited, but I know for a fact I'm not gonna wanna start this video at 3 a.m. The next time you probably see me will be at 3 a.m. We'll see. But yeah, I'm super excited. It's currently 3.35 And we're leaving for the airport It's so way too early for this Oh my, my like a quick brief overview of everything that we did and everything that you just saw so starting off i just want to say thank you so so much to crumble for inviting us out to utah to go to their fifth birthday party and just like everything we did that day like i am so grateful it was so much fun and honestly something i will never forget it was so so much fun so basically we woke up Friday morning bright and early, it was really rough, and flew to Utah. As soon as we landed, we got coffee because why not? After we landed, got our coffee, first coffee of the day because we were exhausted, we took an Uber straight to Crumble headquarters, and oh my god, it was so cool. So they basically just gave us a tour of the whole place and that took forever. I think the highlight of that tour and like being there was seeing the testing kitchen. That is so cool. Like that's where they come up with all the flavors and make the cookies and everything. And we did get to try a couple new cookies and very, very good. And then after we finished the tour, I'm not sure if I showed this, but we did go to So Delicious because in Utah, soda is like a really big thing. And they have multiple like soda shop companies everywhere. So I ended up getting, okay, I'm not really a big soda person, but if I'm gonna drink soda, it's gonna be root beer. So I ended up getting like root beer with toasted marshmallow and it was really good. It was just very, very sweet. And it was basically like a dessert. Like that would have been so good with ice cream as like a little root beer float. But I mean, it was fun to try. And after we went there, we went to lunch at Kitchen 88, which 
honestly really bomb really bomb food was not disappointed love that and then after lunch we went to dutch rose because we were exhausted and needed more coffee and also some of the other influencers we were with have never had dutch rose before so it was their first time and then after dutch we drove up to park city which they had the fifth birthday party at um utah olympic park which was really cool because they had the 2002 winter olympics there so that was really fun to see it was so pretty but it was also freezing like i was so cold it was like 50 degrees and it was so windy it was fun but i was freezing it was so pretty they had zip lining and tubing and an alpine slide so as soon as we got there we ended up going you took like a ski lift up to the alpine slide and honestly we were like oh the line's not short like we'll have time to do everything and the line literally took like an hour and we were all just like standing there like shivering it was so cold but once we finally went down the alpine slide which was fun i've always wanted to do one of those so i was really excited after we went down there um they were starting like the crumble talent show which was really fun a lot of them like could really sing like they were talented and so yeah by the time we were done with the alpine slide like, i think we only had like 20 minutes left to like zip line our tube so my boyfriend and some of the other people went tubing but i was like i'm freezing i'm just gonna stay down at the bottom of the mountain so i went and got food it was so good they had a bunch of food trucks but i ended up getting hawaiian food which was really good and yeah we all just like sat there and ate we hung out took pictures in front of like all the crumble decorations and like the signs we got to see the crumble cake which was of course made out of crumble cookies because what else would they make the cake out of and by this point i think it was around like eight o'clock ish and so we ended up just driving back to crumble headquarters so we could get our stuff but then we ended up trying more cookies i don't know if i can really say much but all i have to say is it was really good and i can't wait for it to come out because I'm so excited. Yeah, and then after that, we went back to our hotel and literally passed out because we were so tired and we had to wake up early the next day and fly back. But yeah, it was so fun. It was a very like hectic day, like nonstop, but I, I just like powered through it as best as I could. Like it was so fun. I'm just like so grateful. I had the opportunity to go like it was so much fun but yeah i kind of just wanted to explain everything because i mean i took clips of everything but i didn't like vlog it i it was just like very hectic there was a lot going on it was non-stop it was just very hard to like vlog but i did post another vlog on my tiktok i posted a bunch of content on my instagram which i can put here and yeah thank you so much for watching this video I'm gonna try and start posting more on YouTube. I have some exciting things coming up this month, so I really wanna vlog that. And yeah, follow me on Instagram, TikTok. Those are like the main two things I post on. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video. And thank you again to Crumble for inviting me out to Utah. I had so much fun and I am forever grateful.